Hey everybody, it's Brett, and today I'm super excited to go over this 2013 Ford Mustang Shelby GT500 convertible in deep impact blue. This is stock number 14401Z. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used sports car headquarters. This car has the 5.8 liter V8 supercharged Trinity engine. Puts out 662 horsepower and 631 foot-pounds of torque paired up with the six-speed manual transmission. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video. This car has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off and it is 100% ready to go. And actually this car is sold at the moment, um, but I wanted to get a video because it is just that nice Obviously the convertible top here is in really nice condition. No rips or tears on that. Deep Impact Blue is the color. Shoot all my videos in 4K. If you like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and sports car walkarounds on YouTube. And stay current on our ever-changing inventory here at Summit Auto so you don't miss out on gems like this one. Unfortunately, this one already has a deposit on it, um, but you can see it comes with the SVT. 19 inch wheels in the front that's part of the SVT performance package. And uh, this is one of 135 co convertibles that were made in Deep Impact Blue for 2013. Uh, but you get the 19 inch wheels in front with the performance package, no scuffs or scrapes on them. They look really good. Goodyear Eagle F1 tires, these are 265 40 ZR19s. These are what would have came on this car new. These are probably the original tires. Um, they have probably three quarters of tread left. Uh, Brembo brakes, of course. This one does have the black side stripes. It also has the black hood decal. You get the Cobra logo on the side here. Front fender, absolutely perfect. It does have the HID headlamps, LED running lights, and the factory fog lights. Um, it has brand new front lower valence pieces. Always a nice touch to redo those. The front bumper has never been drilled into like the matte black stripes on here. The hood is in excellent shape, no dents or dings, and the stripes are in excellent condition as well. You get the heat extraction hood and uh, deep impact blue, it's just a really, really good color. And this color combo is very popular, uh, but the fact is they only made 135 of these in a convertible in 2013, so this is a pretty rare car and why I wanted to get a video on it. Passenger side, front wheel, no scuffs or scrapes. Deep Impact Blue's got just a little bit of metal flake to it. It is the same color as my Shelby GT500, so kind of partial to it. As you go down this side of the car, take note of how clean the body is, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. These cars sound great, they drive great. Just a really, really neat car. And one of the last stick shift GT500s you could get, 2013, 14 were the only two years that they had the 5.8 in them. And it was also the last year, 2014 was when uh, they had the stick shift, was the last year of the stick shift in a GT500. Back wheels are 20 inches and they are 285, 35 ZR20s. And uh, you can see the tread pattern, tread life left on those. The uh, soft top, really nice condition. If you like the video, guys, click the subscribe button. Um, click the bell notification so you get updated every time we get cool cars like this in. As soon as these come out of service, I get them in line to get detailed up so I can do the videos. LED tail lamps, let's take a look inside the trunk. I got a cool thing in here. So all these GT500s come with these build sheets. This one does have the factory um, car cover that comes with it. It also has the Shaker Pro system. And what's cool is you get these build sheets for 2013 and over here are Deep Impact Blue convertibles. So you can see they made 135 of those. Um, these seats in here are very rare only 15 with the black non-Recaro black on black seats in these Deep Impact Blues. So that's a really cool uh, piece there. 117 of these cars came with the stripes 
And then this one has the uh, navigation system, which 114 came. And then the SVT Performance, 113 of them had it. And then the, car, the Shaker Pro, only 80 of them had the Shaker Pro with the convertible and deep impact blue. And only 77 of them had the um, car cover with them. So really cool. Here's the original, a copy of the original window sticker that I just printed up. Um, and you can see this was originally a 67.5 MSRP on this car. I think this one just sold for 63 or 64. So, I mean, over a 10 year old car and it's lost $2,000, $3,000 worth of um, value. So <laughs> this would have been the car to buy in 2013. Uh, it comes with the uh, soft top boot there as well. I always like closing these on the plastic piece here so you don't scratch the paint and you don't get this all marred up with fingerprints and stuff. You get the Shelby GT500 logo there. Uh, rear bumper is absolutely perfect. This one's all stock, hasn't been altered in any way. Does have the capless fuel fill, which is a really nice feature. Um, never get gas on your hands again. And for full disclosure, this back wheel, no scuffs or scrapes, just in case this deal doesn't go through, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna, it's leaving tomorrow. Driver's side door looks fantastic. I'm gonna show you under the hood before we get to the interior. So the 5.8 liter was introduced in 2013. And uh, it's basically just a different version of the 5.4. They uh, took the sleeves out and the cylinder walls and plasma coated them, I think. And uh, they were able to get more displacement by doing that. This one was made by John Devo and Mark, can't read the rest of it, but these are all hand built. And you can always tell who made them, they sign their name on them. You can look them up to see who is all part of that. Um, the Romeo Nish line in Michigan. But uh, all hand built engines, engine bay is very clean. And uh, we're gonna start it up here in just a minute. There is your emission sticker. Let's take a look inside. This car is very clean inside as well. Like I said, it comes with the non Recaro uh, bucket seats. They're leather and suede. You get the Cobra embossed in the backrest, which is really cool. Side curtain airbags, uh, those back seats are fixed, I believe, latch child safety system because of the soft top, but power driver's seat, power windows, power locks, uh, power mirrors right there, auto headlamps, here's your launch control, your dampening system, and the steering control right there. You also get the bright pedals down there. Hop inside, check out the miles and the radio before we start it up. This one has 5,879 miles. Yes, it's making the Ford noises. Uh, you get the Mustang on the dash there, instrument cluster. Very nice and clean. Has the leather and suede wrapped steering wheel, Bluetooth and audio controls on the right, cruise controls, information center controls on the left. You get the Cobra logo on the steering wheel there. Looks really good. This one comes with my favorite radio. It's the uh, touchscreen radio, but you could actually store music on this. You put a CD in, store it onto the hard drive of this radio. AM, FM, and Sirius radio capabilities. You also have, like I said, the media. You get a jukebox where you can download music. Uh, right now it's empty, put a CD in, burns it to the hard drive, and then you can play the music without the CD. So it's pretty cool. More tactile volume tuning climate controls, the dual climate controls, uh, stability control, hazard lights, trunk popper, you get the cue ball shifter right there. This one does have the ambient lighting in it as well. Um, the handbrake there, parking brake, passenger side, floor mat and seat are in excellent condition as well. You get the home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. Let's open up this soft top. Oh, 
got to release them first. Mine is not a soft top. There we go. All right, then once it's done, it stops. All right, let's start it up. Take a listen to that exhaust, do a final walk around here with all the lights on. the exhaust on these GT 500s. LED tail lamps, when you put the turn signals on, they sequential. I can actually turn those on, show you that. Pretty cool. Let's do a final walk around here. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. And hopefully from this HD video, you got a really good look at this extremely clean, low mileage 2013 GT500. There are those HID headlamps, LED running lights, and the factory fog lights. Really, a, really a good looking car. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And uh, to see more pictures of this car, one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, sports cars, GT500s, Camaros, Corvettes, Challengers, Chargers, you name it, we got it. Go to the website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. If you want to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, and stay current on our ever-changing and vast sports car inventory here at Summit Automotive so you don't miss out on gems like this one. I know this one sold before I could get a video, but uh, typically that doesn't happen. So definitely uh, subscribe to the channel, click the bell notifications, and you'll get updated every time I do a video here. In fact, in a second you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the GT500 videos I've ever done in the upper right, over 100 videos in that folder, uh, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out, and we're super excited to be offering cars like this 2013. Ford Mustang, Shelby GT500 in Deep Impact Blue Convertible uh, with the SVT Performance Package. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.